Hey gang, Jack Allaire here. Uh, just wanted to show you this, something strange that happened with the uh, Legion pre-patch. Uh, it's August 9th and the uh, Demon Hunters went live today. Uh, their starting zone is a specific zone that uh, only Demon Hunters can go to. It takes place a year in the past and due to crashes in the game, I actually ended up with my Paladin in there somehow. Uh, so I decided to hang out and uh, entertain some of the new demon hunters, uh, much to the interest of other people, and thought I would share with you a brief video on some of the highlights of what happened here. Alright, here I am taking out some of the mobs that just happen to be standing around. They're all over the place here and they drop uh, all gray loot. The, the few notable exceptions are some of the elites that you'll see later in this video as well as uh, there are a few chests that you can loot and I just kind of poke around in the little nooks and crannies to see what I can find. One of the things that I love that Blizzard does in this starting zone is they play with perspective quite a bit. Because you see from here, it looks like you're just going to go through a cave. And then when you get up here, it opens up into a whole new area. I love the way that they framed that, and then they play with your expectations. Here's one of the elites that drops some uh, better than starting gear. I decide not to kill him here just because there are no demon hunters around and I don't want a, him to be dead when the next demon hunter shows up, so I just decided to move on. Now, while I was in there, the quest givers don't show up, so I would normally see a quest giver here, uh, but he's, or she's, not there, uh, so that they don't give me the quest to go back into the cave. Now, I can still go into the cave, I can kill the quest mob, I just don't get any of the gear or any of the quests. Also, all of the items that drop, uh, they are demon hunter only, so even though I have them, I can't wear them. Now in this cave I saw one of the chests, so I decided to pop in here and uh, kill these guys. They were evading for a little bit. You see the chest in the center of the screen, and most of the time you're just going to get uh, some uh, fell crystals and buffs, healing stones, things like that. Uh, in this case I got both the legion health stones as well as the buffs that make you do, I believe it's 10% more damage. Uh, but they're both soul bound, so I can't sell them. But they're cool little trinkets to throw in the bank and just keep a hold of. Now here's another one of the elites, and somebody's already fighting him. So I'm just gonna go ahead and hop on in here and kill him. Lend a hand a bit. souls on him! Please, 
Your soul will now power my engine. The zone is beautiful. It's sad that demon hunters are going to be the only ones to see it. I kind of wandered off on this ledge here and just... It's just very pretty to look at. Thought I'd share it for a moment. On him. This is just another fight with the same boss. I've just turned off the UI. There was nothing in here that proved the challenge to me. And I use an MMO mouse, so I don't need to see where my buttons are. I have them all mapped on there. I thought this was funny. There's this little gap in the road, and demon hunters have the ability to double jump as well as glide. Uh, so for people who are demon hunters, that jump is no problem. Being on a pet, it makes that really hard. That's it for me. There's a link to the unedited version down below. Thank you for watching, and as always, play on! May your blessings be many.